Yes, hello and welcome everybody to another video on TG Productions and it's the four year celebration video. Yes, TG Productions has been going on for four years. I know my about section says February 2013 of when I made the channel but it was not a Doctor Who channel and the Doctor Who content started around August time 2013. The first real Doctor Who video I did was my Doctor Who DVD showcase number one which I uploaded the 5th of August 2013. Yeah, for my four year celebration video, I've got one video planned, and yeah, I teased it in my recent video. I will be unboxing something pretty damn big. I'm gonna be unboxing the Doctor Who WH Hannon Deluxe of the early years. Definitely the best way, I would say, to celebrate four years of this channel and four years of the showcase series. Unboxing something which, you know, not only is it incredibly expensive and, and is the second most valuable Doctor Who book you can get. But the Early Years Deluxe has been my most wanted Doctor Who item. I discussed it so many times in showcase videos to say I want this damn book so much. It appeared on my top 5 or top 10, I can't remember which one, of my most wanted Doctor Who items. The Early Years Deluxe was number one. But yes, I like to say thanks to everyone who's been following the channel. If you subscribed way back when it started, August 2013 or 2014, 15, 16 or quite recently this year. Thank you for subscribing, thank you for following the channel. Thanks for the support, the nice comments, the likes, everything. Really appreciate it. And yeah, with like 2016 and 2017, there hasn't been like a massive amount of content and videos coming out really when you like compare stuff to 2013. 2014 or 2015 and of course time isn't really on my side anymore as it was but yeah everyone says this quality over quantity but yes to be honest my mind is just on this goddamn book i cannot stop thinking about it i just want to open it right now and see it with my own eyes because as i said it's been a dream to own this and i've been searching for this for about eight months to no avail i just struggled to find any place where this was about on the internet. I couldn't find it when talking to collectors, they didn't have it. But there was one I was aware of for quite a while on ABE Books and it was very expensive. It was listed for the price is actually valued at. And I was just looking for Asia saying, yeah, it's 500 quid. That's bloody expensive for a book, that is. Again, its value is correct and spot on. So I was saying to myself, keep an eye on it, but just look around on the internet. Just look everywhere for it and I had no luck whatsoever so I said fudge it we're just going for it but I'm not I didn't want to pay the 500 quid for it even though I wanted it so much I made him an offer and he accepted it did and probably one of the best people I've ever done a deal with now I have my most of my Doctor Who item of all time now it's just popped in my head that I actually own all the WH Allen Deluxe books now which is very nice because they're all just um, fantastic looking books. But yeah, WH Allen, they not only did um, the Target hardback, but they also did like some special releases like 25 Glorious Years, Key to Time, Celebration, The Early Years, and only three of them actually had deluxe treatment. Again, I think it was a bit of a missed opportunity. They didn't do, um, you know, ones like 25 Glorious Years, the um, Time Travelers one, the Doctor Who file. I think that was a bit of a missed opportunity because again I love collecting and whatnot like the deluxe format so to me it's a bit of a missed opportunity but I've got all three of them now and if you're wondering what they are that is the key to time which is definitely one of the more most gorgeous Doctor Who books you can ever get and it's limited up to a thousand and mine is 838 and then this was the most popular WH Allen release of all time. The uh, Celebration, the standard edition, sold like over 100,000 copies. It did. It was incredibly popular. And then here's the deluxe format. Limited to 500 copies, this one. Came out in the 80s, these books did. Wonderful books. And I said with the last one, the only is deluxe. I said to myself, you know, this one's going to be a real, real pain to find. 
because it came out in the 80s, all they're really doing now is just lying in people's collections and not a lot have ever been listed on the internet before. Because this is just something completely different, this Doctor Who book. It's the most valuable Doctor Who book I own. Even though that War Machine hardback is definitely nice and unique, uh, this is definitely worth more. You know, compared to the Talos Deluxe books and just everything I have, this is just like the ultimate king unboxing which I'm going to be doing. Because again, it's value is just through the bloody roof. Yes, yeah, such an honor to have it. Let's waste no time. This is gonna take a while to open because look at that. I've actually got a timer over there to see how long it actually takes me to open this. So, without no further ado, let's open this up. It's open and I can see it. Freaking out here. Yeah. Let's put it on the table. And let's reveal the Yulia's Deluxe. And yeah, that took... I well, actually didn't take too long, really, just 2 minutes and 35 seconds to open. I've just thought it would take longer because it's packaged really well. So thanks to the seller to that. I've opened the parcel. And yeah, I'm going to have to move the camera back on this one because the book is absolutely ginormous. Yeah, it's like the same size as the celebration are back and again I'm just ecstatic that I've got this now and yeah I've talked about it for a couple of months it's been a massive discussion during like late 2016 and 2017 I think I discussed it quite a lot when the ultimate showcase and people thought like this book would be in the ultimate showcase but the thing is I could never find it couldn't find a single trace of it and yeah, I do have um, kind of a massive story because this wasn't just um, a buy now, pick it up thing because I didn't want to do that and spend 500 quid on it. I actually directly got this from the person who owned the book and emailed him with an offer and, you know, he accepted and he's probably the best person I've ever dealt with and um, purchased off and pleasure to do business with because he helped me so much to get this in my collection. He didn't mind if I paid it in installments and he reserved it for me for a month. Pay off everything and whatnot. And yeah, an absolutely brilliant service with a Red Doctor Who books or just Red books generally if you like that field. Yeah, pretty crazy enough that uh, Ashton Red Books actually own two of these. They don't have the other one that was sold quite some time ago, about like a few years ago. And yet they've had this one for quite some time. And yeah, I was aware of this one for ages about six months really on ABE books but I just didn't want to take the risk of going for it because I could find it cheaper somewhere else but I just gave up in the end because I couldn't find it anywhere else all they're doing really is just lying in people's collections and I just wanted it so bad that I said I'm just going for it doing an offer and yeah I'm definitely pleased with my decision because the person I bought this off is probably one of the best people I've ever dealt with so yeah let's reveal the early years deluxe. Again, it's wrapped up very well. Oh god, my paws are crazy. And let's just very slowly remove the bubble wrap. God, I'm. Oh, I just uh, can't accept that I've got this. Again, 10 out of 10 service. Oh wow, this feels magnificent. It feels old for some reason. And we put it there. It feels like a very old fashioned book, so I'm a, definitely a fan of that. And yeah, I got a lovely letter from the person who I got this from, Ashton Rare Books. Feels really old fashioned. And here we go. We will be taking the Early Years Deluxe out. And here it is. The absolute gorgeous beautiful looking WH Allen Deluxe of the early years.
So here we go everyone, the earliest deluxe in all its glory and it, it feels out of this world and it's like a dream. <laughs> it's wonderful to have it because as I said, I've dreamed to have, I've dreamed to have a Stone 2 book. Yeah, it's come with his slip case, which is in good condition. Again, it feels really old, it does, so I approve of that, as I said. And let's show the beautiful early years deluxe in all its glory. First time showcasing it. See it on the front cover, simplistic design. We have a Dalek designed in the centre of the front cover with a lovely leverette material. Yeah, it's fully case bound with a lovely gilt locked leather. And what I really love about the book is the spine, because it definitely has that old book look to it. And in the back, it's completely blank again with the case bound leverette material. Again, this book has a nice smell from it. Again, it smells like an old Dog Do book. And when we open it up, it has the yellow ribbon, of course, and then Big stuff of course. This is a limited edition from the 80s, limited to 200 copies. My number is 117. And it is personally signed by Jeremy Bentham and Raymond P. Cusick, who designed the Daleks. And of course, very similar design and layout to the key to time, this time showcasing Daleks. And here we have a nice blank white page, which I would like to get signed. Of course, a non-dedicated, obviously. That is the plan. This, that's the plan. Again, I've showcased inside the Early Years Deluxe because I have the standard edition and it is a wonderful book to cover the design aspects, covering the Daleks and covering the era of the first Doctor. If you're a fan of the first Doctor, if you like 60s Doctor Who, then this book is a must. And 60s Doctor Who is my favorite era of the show I love the Hartnell era. I personally find it quite shadowed, I would say. Again, some people do appreciate it. Some people don't really look at the Hartnell era as other people do. There we go. That is the Yulia's Deluxe. It also teases and it will carry on with the second Doctor. But yeah, that is my most wanted Doctor Who book added to my collection, but my most wanted Doctor Who item of all time. So here it is, Ulias Deluxe showcase. Also, it's got some really nice gold pages as well, which I forgot to showcase on this Doctor Who book. So you're probably wondering now, what is my most wanted Doctor Who item now? To be honest, I never had a feeling of getting a book with Ulias Deluxe. Nothing else has had that spark or interest, really. So I'm really just going for Doctor Who books now because this one, you know, really. I really had motivation to try and find this and you know eventually I got round to finding it. Again I was aware that it was on ABE books for a while but I just didn't want to make the move on it because it could be somewhere else for a cheaper price but um, no luck, nothing so I went for the ABE books one, did the offer, accepted and thanks very much to Ashton Rare Books. Now I have this in my collection. But yeah, going back, what is my most wanted Doctor Who book now, or Doctor Who item? Well, I suppose, I guess the next step, the only way I can go up now, is to, there's a, a Doctor Who book called Doctor Who Specialist Collector's Edition of Cybermen by Who Dares. It came out in 1998, sorry, 1988, and it was limited to 75 copies. There's a deluxe version of that. And yeah, I limited to 75 copies done in the late 80s. I I've tried to look for that one before, but I haven't found a single trace of it. All I know is that I actually found one on eBay as a record. It sold for 800 quid, so it's also a record of it going to the thousand pound mark. So yeah, that is no book. <laughs> That's definitely the king of the Doctor Who books, absolutely. Yeah, this is second on the list for me, yeah. Comes to value, absolutely, and I do have a plan. Get some non-dedicated signatures here from some of the cast members and some of the, and some of the actors and the characters who appeared 
in the first stop to hear us. To get this sign would just be so massive to me, that word. So here we go. Gorgeous early years to Lax. Definitely the way to celebrate four years of TG Productions and four years of the showcase series to unbox something which I it's been a dream to have it. And I hope this inspires you to find your dream Doctor Who item because this was it for me. Because even though, yeah, I'm a massive Doctor Who book collector, I think it wasn't really possible for me to get this, really. The only way would be to really put in the money. And sad to say, that is how you... That is the only way you can get it. But if you want something that much, you would you just go for it. So yeah, hope this inspires you to get your most wanted Doctor Who item. If it's the Invasion of Christmas Target done by the Midnight Folk. If it's the Cyberman Collector's Edition by Who Dares. If it's the Notorious DVD of the Web Planet. Which, of course, some people will understand what I'm on about there and will know what I'm talking about. Whatever it is, I hope this video inspires you to one day find it, because I found my most wanted Doctor Who item for four years at TJ Productions.